Anybody, guys? Would you do that with kids? Say, skill wise, you know, the breaking tackles and yeah, that type of stuff. 100%. Or your tailor as well, yeah. 100%. Under the pinup. Huh? Under the pinup. I, I don't see why, like. Yeah. Shlass, is that not the nature of the skill? Is that not a skill of the game? Do you know what I mean? Like, there was a time there when lads with no helmets and they're always able to protect themselves. Do you know what I mean? When kids were kids, they never got broken teeth or stitches to the level that they would now, so that's the skill of the game. I'm just going to kind of go in on a couple of my own principles, right? The first thing is, you as a coach have got to be cognizant of what's in front of you. When I say what's in front of you, there's children in front of you. We don't know the homes they've come from. We don't know if they've had breakfast. We don't know if dad is telling them this should be the next Henry Shefflin. We don't know what they're coming from. But the one thing we have to do is listen to children, all right? At the end of the day, you are not playing the match. This isn't a game of PlayStation. We have to ask them, what do you think? Because they're smarter than what you know. And what that then becomes the thing called explicit learning. Sorry, implicit learning, apologies. Implicit learning, all right? Explicit is where somebody's telling, telling you loads, telling you loads, telling you loads, all right? You might retain that much of it. Implicit is where you create a situation there, leave them play it out. Automatically, when things don't work, they've already learned something. That is coaching. Coaching is where you attend to people's mistakes. That is coaching. All right, and that's how you go about that. That's just one element of it. And I'm going back to the very basics. That's head, hands, feet moving the whole time. Okay, they talk about in coaching about this whole idea of steps to make a drill harder. So what they mean by steps is, as they get better, reduce the space, yeah? Okay, reduce the time, bring in equipment, put extra pressure, and you do that as you layer a session. As kids move from that under 10 up to inter-county senior. Okay? Again, and it's, like the last thing here is, like as a kind of a, as a coach, like, you're kind of the guide on the side. You're not the be all end all, you're just the guide on the side. You're there on the side to help them. They're the main act, they're what matters.